Hey guys, so I'm back with another review. Um, I've noticed I've not seen a lot of videos on this particular shoe, so I thought I would do um, a review. Uh, I got these shoes maybe a couple months ago. I really don't have a good sense of time. I know I got them before I went to Ibiza. Then I went to Ibiza in June. Maybe I got them at the end of May. Yeah, okay. So anyway, this is how they come. They are the Giuseppe Zanotti and as the title say, they're Giuseppe Zanotti Cruels or the Cruel Summers. And this shoe first came out uh, a few years ago. Uh, I think it was it was a collaboration with uh, Giuseppe Zanotti and Kanye West. And the first ones had like a bent heel. The heel was really uh, unique looking. Um, they've since changed the style. Oh, you know, I'm going to show you all this. They've since changed the, st changed the style and now the heel is straight as you will see because these are um, brand new. So, yeah, I opened the box. This is the dust bag. Comes with a pretty nice dust bag. They actually have really good packaging. Uh, it's just that piece of milky. So I'll put this aside. I have my tissue paper. And there's one shoe. And the other shoe. And I kept the tissue paper. I've only worn them once since I've gotten them. And the thing with this shoe, it's such a flashy shoe. I don't know the wearability on it as far as how often I would get to wear the shoe. But I've wanted them for years. I feel like this shoe, um, my, my girlfriend actually said it and I completely agree. This shoe is definitely a must have for a fashionista, I believe. Just, you know, my personal opinion. So I'll take them out of the packaging to see, to show you. And they have a multitude of colors. This is the gold. This is the true gold. They have some with bronze. They have a pair that are bronze and black. Those are the first ones. They have a stark white, a really white. And they have a um, a very, very pale gray. I actually had bought these along with the pale gray to kind of decide which one I wanted to keep and return. Um, I returned the pair that... I didn't think I would. I just I bought both trying to decide on which color I wanted and I sent the gray ones back it hurt me to my heart to return like I wanted the gray ones too I wanted them both but anyway here they are and they are they're about 110 millimeter uh, millimeters and or are they once no I think they're 120 I'm not sure I'll put all that information in the description bar but it's not a like a true 120 as far as like other shoes because there is a platform as, as you can see so like I cannot walk in 120s I mean I, I can walk of course I can walk in 120s but it is painful like so Kate's the Christian lupus and so Kate's I do not own a pair I will not buy a pair um any regular flat shoe with meaning no platform and it's 120 millimeters I don't even purchase them because they're just too it's just too uncomfortable for me now are these shoes comfortable I would tell you no I have a girlfriend that has a pair um she finds them comfortable kudos to her um I don't find them comfortable I have another girlfriend that has them she doesn't find them comfortable um Shout out to you, Rylan, if you're watching this. But yeah, here are the shoes. I am going to try them on for you to see. I'm going to put some lotion on my feet. And I'll be back and um, show you guys. But this is the shoe again. And it's these, um, I think these are flames. Yeah, I think, yeah, they're flames. You got one, two, three, four, four flames. The heel platform it says uh, made in Italy Vero I don't know and these are in the size 36 and a half I okay so I have unique feet I'm 
where a lot of people size up in Christian Louboutin, I actually have sized down in some shoes. Reason being, I have very narrow feet, so I'm actually a true 37, but because this is an open toe shoe and it's, um, you know, a sandal, I was able to size down. So, and I've tried the 37s on, those fit, 36 and a half fit to, um, and I actually have one foot is a whole size larger than the other. So, yeah, that's interesting and of course i put the protector pumps on the soles of them i do this with all of my shoes like i said before it protects these gold the soles from getting scuffed and getting dirty and all of that so like i said i will link that company in the description bar as, along with a 15 percent coupon code but here are the shoes i love i love these shoes so much they're quite expensive. They retail for about, oh yeah. Um, well, it's expensive to me. Uh, they retail, some of, some retailers say $1,600. I've also seen $1,595. So that's that. Uh, and that's US dollars. Don't know how much they are um, overseas. Probably cheaper as everything is cheaper in Europe. So <laughs> yeah, but like I said, I'll be back to show you the shoes on. Um, I love the shoes. I can't talk, like I said, I can't talk too much about them because I've only worn them one time. But I feel like I wanted these shoes forever. As expensive as they are, I totally think it was worth it because I wanted them for a long time. And they have a lot of colors. They come, they just have different seasonal colors. They have a blue, they have red, silver. I actually really wanted the silver. They didn't have silver in my size. You see the gold, I told you bronze, I told you white, I told you light gray. I'm trying to think other ones I've seen. The one color they haven't come out yet is pink. They come out with a pink one, I may have to get those. Um, and of course black. The black ones are the black ones are crazy dope. Um, and another friend of mine just got the red. I need to talk to her, see how she likes them. But yeah, I'll be back. See you guys. Well, don't go away. I'll be back. And I will insert pictures also the end of the video with me having them on when I was out of town when I was in Spain I wore them then all right so I'll be back so here they are on my feet um I can stand up I'll probably stand up in a little bit to show you but I mean this is about it it's not much to say about shoes unlike purses <laughs> but um yeah I really like them I'll stand up really quick. They're just such a statement shoe. It's like really in your face. And just, it's just such a bold shoe. These are by far the boldest shoes I have. I have a pair of Dior shoes that are pretty bold. I think Valentino Rock Studs are bold, but these are the boldest. Um, let's see, further away. That's pretty much it. <laughs> All right, guys, thanks for watching.